Hey guys, we're now at the Oris stand. Let's change perspective and take a closer look at Oris, guys. Hey guys, we're with the lovely Isra at the Oris stand here at Watch Pro Salon Live. Hello Isra, how are you? Fantastic, how are you finding the show? Really good, it's nice and buzzy, it's good It good is, yeah. amazing. And uh, so tell us a little bit about yourself, what's your role? At Oris. Yeah, I'm the sales and marketing director for the UK of Oris. Ah, fantastic. Well, we're very big fans of Oris here on the D-Time Love channel. We've got a lot of supporters and they're going to be intrigued to look at some of your new releases. Okay. So we're going to sort of highlight and showcase some of your new releases for 2022. So what do we have here? So this is the Profiler X Calibre 400. We launched this at Watches and Wonders this year. Um, it's our it's our, it's our, it has an automatic in-house movement, it has a Calibre 400 movement, which offers a five-day power reserve. Five days, wow, yeah. that's amazing. Uh, it, it's it's anti-magnetic, and it offers a 10-year warranty as well. 10-year warranty, yeah. wow. Yeah, and what's really special about this watch, it's a very classic-looking um, kind of pilot watch. Um, it's made with a titanium bracelet, titanium case, very, very light, lightweight, and very easy to wear. And also, kind of factoring in the combination of the in-house movement, also the material that we've used as well, it's just a very good everyday watch. So what, this is titanium, yeah? Titanium, what grade yeah. titanium is it, do you know? I think it's grade, would be grade two, do you think? Maybe grade two. Grade two, yeah, yeah. fantastic. It feels, it feels very light, obviously it's titanium, light, yeah. but it feels great. Yeah, and it great. comes in three different colorways. I mean, we have a salmon dial, we have a, a blue dial as well, and a gray dial. Quite nice. Well, the Calibre 400 we launched in October 2020 on our first ever automatic in-house movement. It's really, really exciting and big for Oris. Uh, and it's really, it's really setting a new standard for Oris um, with our movements and with our new collection. You'll see the in-house movement and a lot of our new watches. Amazing, amazing. And what's the retail price of this piece? 3200 And if anyone's interested, what would be the best way to register their interest? in this particular time piece? Well, we have an Oris boutique in London. Uh, it's located in Mayfair and South Morton Street. So okay. you can either get it, you can either, you know, have a look in person over there. We also work with, you know, 144 locations in, in and around the UK and Ireland um, with multiple retailers. Fantastic, fantastic. So what else would you like to show us today? You've got a lot, yeah. I love Oris, they've got a real wide lineup, haven't they? Yeah, well, oh. I, want to, I want to show you this watch. We launched it earlier oh, wow. this year. Um, it's called the, it's an, it's an, it's an Oris Aquis watch. Oh, look at that doll, I mean. Yeah, it's another of dial. Oh, exactly. yeah. And it's called the New York Harbour Limited Edition watch. So look at this, the way it plays with the light. It's, uh, it's beautiful, isn't it? Um, Alex, do you think you could, um, can you um, rotate the bezel for us so we can hear the uh, bezel sound? <laughs> so this, we're going to get a watchmaker's approval. How does it feel, Alex? Feels good. Feels very uh, positive. There's no kickback on it. The dial is beautiful. Look at that MOP dial. Yeah. Let's turn it over. Hey, is this 10 year uh, service warranty as well? No, so this doesn't have in-house movement in it. But what's really special about this watch is that I don't know if you know this, but Oris are a very sustainable company. We announced our carbon neutral status last year, mm. actually this year. And um, what's, what's really nice is that this watch we worked in collaboration with the new, with, they call the Billion Oyster Project in, in, the New York Harbor, in the New York Harbor, so the Hudson River. Mm. And they're trying to plant a billion oysters into the, new, in, into the Hudson River. Oh, wow. And the idea is very much like the, the oysters are the lungs of the ocean, so they're basically cleaning and filtering the water. Right. So we really want to bring uh, out to highlight this amazing thing that we're doing. So we created these special watches uh, kind of to, to, to kind of launch that with it. It's a good looking watch. The green, what type of green would you say that is, Alex? I don't know, it's hard to... Uh, I can't, can't think of the... It's like extra sage. virgin olive oil. <laughs> Exactly. Yeah. Or it's Christmas Eve for Christmas. <laughs> you know, um, it's beautiful, isn't it? And I like the integrated. Is that like a rubber strap? Is that? It is. Yeah. yeah, it's a rubber strap. It actually also comes with a metal bracelet as well. Fantastic. And what's the retail price of this one? It's a good price, isn't it? It is. What's the movement? Is it Salita inside? Salita, yeah. So it's obviously a reliable movement. Exactly. And what's the year's warranty on it? It has a, so we have a two-year standard warranty. And if you purchase the watch, our customers can extend it for one more year. One year. And this one has 10. It's a 10-year warranty. So you don't have to pay for anything for 10 whole years. Well, yeah, no, exactly. That's, that's amazing, that's... Nice. So the saving on that alone. Yeah. Mechanical watches every three to four years that cost uh, around 300 plus every three to four years. So you're saving on that. 
just just alone, aren't you? So yeah. that's that's brilliant. I like that. I like the dial. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. That would suit you, though. That would, yeah. I like that. <laughs> very nice, very nice. So, I can see you've got some different colour palettes here, haven't you now? Yeah, so these are our cotton candies. Have you ever tried this one? No, I've never tried this. Ah, okay, so this is a really special watch. I mean, I, I have a cotton candy myself. I actually have the blue dial. I'm a big fan of bronze watches. And Horace has bronze very, very well, in my opinion. I love a patina. I always take my one to, to the beach when I'm, um, uh, when I'm on holiday. And it, it, the patina really develops really, really well. We actually launched a special, um, uh, this is a PT, PT um, uh, recycled plastic uh, strap. So this is recently launched. It comes in, the actual watch comes in three different colorways. So you can, eat, you can either get it on a full bracelet or leather strap, or you can get it on the recycled plastic strap now as well. And what's the price of this one? 1,900 on the bracelet. 1,900 on the bracelet. Fantastic. The dome glass. Dome glass, yeah. Beautiful. So, I can see you've got a lot of ground. You've got like a pistachio colour as well, a green as well. There's a lot going on here. What about that blue one? Can I have a look at that blue one as well, please? Yeah? So, this actually. Look at that. I really like this watch because this has our in house movement. I love this. This is amazing. Um, so, this is actually 18 karat gold. Oh, wow. And this has an in house movement. So, this has a five day power reserve, as well, 10 year wow. warranty, anti magnetic, and obviously, it's, a, it's our in house caliber 400 movement. What I actually quite like about this watch is obviously the rubber strap is really cool. But you can actually, it has a quick release strap. So, it means, she says very ambitiously on camera, it means that you can. <laughs> don't worry, don't worry. <laughs> no pressure. No pressure, no pressure. It's a lot harder when you're on camera, isn't it? Yeah, exactly. Very new watch, so you can get a little bit easier. I don't know. 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 I I so hold the mic guys and yeah uh, let's see Alex in action he's a real watchmaker he's a wasp certified watchmaker so if Alex can't do it, then um, the novice will struggle. <laughs> oh, here we go. Look at the skill set, guys. Alexandros Fodi, the world famous watchmaker, <laughs> demonstrates his skills live on the detail. First time lucky. Well. First time lucky, more like. <laughs> <laughs> it's beautiful. It looks good on you, Alex. That looks good. That's a beautiful blue, that is. Now, Oris are a real watch enthusiast watch, isn't it? They're for your dive, divers, hardcore enthusiasts. But you know, your popularity is great, you're still independent, you're not part of the bigger groups, and I see that you have a little bit more adventurous design as well in terms of the materials that you use and the colour palettes as well. It's Fantastic. True. It's true. And, you know, I mean, as an independent brand, it means we can really go our own way. We can, you know, we don't Show it to the screen, Alex. Let's have a look at the camera. That's nice green. Oh, that's beautiful, that is. It's like a big netty dial. And priced very competitively. They are, yeah. Listen. You know, we don't work with we don't work with big um, kind of, we don't work with celebrities. We don't work with very big ambassadors. It means that we can add a, we can invest some money back into the watches. Yeah, and yeah. for us, it's really the watches that have to do the talking. Yes, Everything yes. really needs to make sense of Aura. So even yeah. the the watches when we make them, for example, with the New York Harbor with the in-house movement, they need to be made for purpose. You know, all of our all of our diving watches, you can they're functional watches. You can dive with them, and that's a really important want to think about when you're when we're creating our watches um, you know we recently collaborated with we have a sponsorship with um, the uh, MCC and Lords and, and uh, we're now the official timekeeper of, of, of the MCC and Lords in amazing so, amazing and that was also a very a, a very kind of well thought out uh, uh, sponsorship opportunity because it's an amazing organization they're doing a lot of sustainability they're doing a lot of awareness and diversity um, yeah. fantastic so, so, when you walk into your showroom, what really puts a smile on your face? Well, it has to be the Oris Bear. I mean, you know, 
Oh, the Oris Fair. <laughs> Looks like you this one. Yeah, this does, yeah. It's a, it's a better looking version of me. But, uh, I mean, in regards to timepiece, what's the most popular one, the one most in demand? Uh, I have to say that, you know, there are a few pieces that have, have, have done very well over the last few years. I mean, our most popular watch overall is definitely the collection of watches, the Aquis. The Aquis yeah. is very, very popular. The Aquis is your icon, is it? It's the yeah, icon. exactly. But then equally, our, our, you know, our, our profile, sorry, our, our uh, big crown profile. Oh, yeah, they look really... Sorry, are, are very, yeah. very popular as well. Very nice. I mean, this, these are some of these are some new limited editions that we're working with. But I think also what really what people are really excited about are, are things like our in-house movement. They're really, really interested to learn about the, the Caliber 400 um, movement and kind of what it has, what it is offering. And then I suppose the third thing is the limited edition watches that we make and the stories that we can tell through those. So you know whether it's the whether it's the New York Harbor limited edition or whether it's the um, the Payun limited edition, which brings awareness to you know uh, endangered species around the world. So this is a it, this is actually based on an endangered species in Thailand. So the green dial. The green dial, yeah. It's yeah. very unique, isn't it? That. What colour do you call that? I know it's green, but what's the... What's the official word? Yeah. What do you like to call it? Well, uh, this looks this like a watermelon. Now. This one? Watermelon? It looks like a bit of a watermelon, though. I think that looks like a watermelon. It could be called Galpuzi, Batika, whatever you want to call it, but uh, for the UK Brits, we call it uh, watermelon. Very juicy. <laughs> That's, what I call it. That's a juicy one. <laughs> A uh, very vibrant in colour, isn't it? To be fair, so. Um, and what's your and what's your favourite Oris watch? My favourite Oris is probably these Aquis. These, yeah, yeah the original Aquis. You know, you can't go wrong, really. Yeah. One of those. A, a green down Aquis watch, you can't. Go no, wrong. I like the blue one. I, I like the blue one. I love your, I love the straps they come on. You know, they're really high quality. I've got an Aquis myself, so I can't really say I've got nothing bad to say. I only can sing their praises. They're great value for money. And have you noticed that they smell like vanilla? Yes, yes. <laughs> Alex, you smell nice today. <laughs> so it's the first, isn't it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> it smells lovely. Alex smells of vanilla, guys. So um, it's all good. Well, look, it's been absolutely fantastic to have you on the D-Time Love channel. And the, this is the lady behind the brand, the marketing director, guys. So if anyone was interested in registering or interested in any of the timepieces, what would be their first step of action? So we have a boutique in London, in Mayfair. It's on South Mall Street. Like um, the boutique is open from Monday to Saturday, so you're all welcome to come in, have a beer, have a glass of wine. Uh, fantastic. And will you be there? I'm sometimes there. Oh, fantastic. Yeah, Again, all the guys on the channel will be there now. Oh, yeah. That's for sure. <laughs> and obviously we have all of our retailers as well. And fantastic. We have Fantastic. Well, look, I remember um, speaking to one of your guys at World Time pre-COVID and they had, um, is it Save the Ocean, yes. the triple, they, 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 they're no longer available anymore, I take it? That's a yeah, limited edition. Yeah, you'd be very lucky to find it. We have a few exciting watches that we've recently launched, which is... Uh... They were really good because they used the plastics, recycled plastic, for the case bag. I just thought that's a very... Have you seen our, have you seen our upside watch? No, let's have, have a look. Yeah. Um, so Sorry. So this watch is actually the um, Oris, oh, here we go. Yeah, Oris yeah. Upcycle. So we actually, the dial is created using um, using plastic from the ocean. So every single watch dial is unique. It comes in two different sizes as well. Not one is the same, right? Not one is the same, no. yeah. And actually it's been quite nice because we've had such a great buzz from this watch that a lot of customers are, coming, are going to each of our retailers trying to find the perfect dial for them. So they're saying, oh, one is a bit, too, you know, they want to find the perfect blue, something which is a little bit more green, which has flecks of pink inside it. So yeah, it's quite yeah. nice. And this is the whole range of the Aquis here, yes. as we can see. So let's get a closer look. This one's, this one's beautiful, look at it. Yeah. You, which is your favourite? It's actually, uh, I've never tried it on. It's this one here, I'll show D now. It's this. Oh, did you? Yeah, yeah, pretty nice. It has an octo Hey guys, you join me now at an exhibition stand, but I'm really excited to showcase to you guys on the channel. We're at Speak Marine a brand that's coming up to their 20th anniversary. Guys, we're with Speak Marine. We're gonna to speak to the man 
one of the guys behind Speak Merriman. We've got Julian here, and today he's going to show us some very intriguing watches. And as you saw earlier in the introduction of Speak Marine, Alex is immensely impressed with the oh, brand, well, I have to say. I've always, always wanted to see Speak Marine watches in Fantastic. person. Fantastic. So where, where should we start? Do you want to show us the one with the, the orange? So let's start with this Okay, one this one. Then. Okay. Fantastic. So we introduced a few in-house calibers yeah. recently. It's like step by step, but from uh, 2017, 2018. So we have a micro rotor, hour, minute, seconds. Yeah. Another one which is uh, open work, which is hour, minute, seconds. This one is three hands caliber yeah. with the particularity of having the seconds at 130 all the time. Yeah, beautiful, fantastic. Then we, have, then we have the dual time. Oh, this is something else, isn't this it? This is the dual one. time, yeah. Beautiful. Char characteristic is always the same. It's seconds at 130, integrated micro rotor, strong element at 130, which is in this case the Absolutely stunning. The retrograde date. It's that classical Speed Marine uh, case. This is what I've always liked, that case that he's done with that certain crown. Yeah. The crown is extremely important in the design. The legs as well. Lugs are very important, but they are also very comfortable now. If before the lugs were going outside the case and the yeah, strap, flared, like, like yeah. Time, yeah. and the strap was going under, it was not going next to the case and not under the case. Like here, you can see, it's under the case, right. so it's okay. so it's more, it's easier to wear it every day. Can I try this one? Absolutely. They are all here for. Okay. This one is the dual time, so you have the home time, which is based on 24 hours, the date, retrograde date, which is linked to the home time and then the local time, which is uh, the hand. And is this in-house as well? It's in-house as well. When oh. we say in-house, <laughs> we develop it internally, mm. but because but we work with external yeah. partners to actually provide components that we design, because we have only 20 years of experience. Yeah, so it's still relatively still, young, but considering We, we have the experience, because we have the people, who are knowledgeable in yeah. the industry. On the other side, we rely on external suppliers because they're extremely high, they are equipped, they have very knowledge on the hands, spurling Nova indication, mainspring, and so on. So, so would you make? So would you say that makes more sense that the fact that because you're only 20 years old, but you can work with other watchmakers and other and other designers, that you can actually implement such technology rather than 40, 50, 60 years old? You can actually. Do you understand what I mean? I understand. I, what I what I understand is it gives us more flexibility to rely on. External knowledge as well, yeah. and external partners to actually get the best out of it, because you cannot be expert in everything. No, no, that's what I mean. So you can work with others and produce something exceptional, yeah. because everyone talks about in-house, 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 but it's not always the case, is it? We, I don't think so. For us, when we say in-house, it's actually in-house developed in-house for Speak Marine exclu yeah. exclusively to Speak Marine. And that's it. Can I ask how much this is? This is about twenty-four thousand uh, pounds. So Limited edition of thirty pieces. So considering there's only thirty, pe 30 pieces and how complex it is, it's still relatively well priced. It's it's a good positioning. I would definitely it's, say. Yeah, hundred percent. Yeah, definitely say. The idea is we want people to wear their watches. Uh, put it closer on the screen, Alex. Just put it closer to the camera. And also, the chance of you going into a restaurant or a bar and seeing someone else wear the same watch is, is extremely small. Let's be honest. Yes. So it's very original. You've got the exclusivity here. Extremely this is a brand where you want to have something that no one else has. Exactly. This is the brand for you. And the workmanship is absolutely sublime. And this, this strap is beautiful, isn't it? 
it's fun, you know. It's uh, we are young as a company, so we we can we can be creative as well in the association of colors. We can be it's 20 millimeters in between lugs, so it's very comfortable to actually adjust a new strap and to play around. So it's a highly complex piece. It's stunning. Beautiful, beautiful piece, Julian. I have to say. And um, what else would you like to showcase to us today? Uh, the ripples. Beautiful. The ripples was introduced this year and is uh, truly a game changer for the company. Amazing. Look at the detail there, guys. Well, See, when you look at the dial, I mean, look, so many different layers, it looks like. Yeah, it's, we call it the ripples. So you have a first layers on the outside. Yes. Which is at the lower, lowest part. And then you have the ripples adjustment which is slightly curved on the bottom. So the light reflection is actually very unique to speak Marian, because no one ever produced a dial in this, uh, in this direction, in this way. Yes. Even if it looks familiar, as soon as you have a light on, it does yeah. it. Beautiful. And uh, can I ask how much that is the bike? It's uh, 19,000. 19,000. Mm -hmm. This one is not limited edition. Right, okay. So it's becoming a bit more commercial. On, uh, can I say something? I would actually say that for the price of this is, is actually a very, very, very affordable considering what you get. I do honestly believe that. It's extremely important for us to, uh, to have the people wearing the watch. Yes. That's because for us, uh, wearing is actually important for people to share it as well and to enjoy their watches. It's in, yeah, so beautiful. Detail. And you've got a very pe special piece here, Julian. <laughs> yeah, I'd exactly. have to say, I mean, this here. This piece was actually introduced um, uh, during uh, Watches and uh, SSIHH, which was in 2019. Okay. We introduced the first minute repeater in a sapphire case. Fantastic. And we, we, we show you some footage of that earlier on. It's absolutely amazing. Do you want to turn it around so we can see the movement, sir? Absolutely. Get a closer look for you guys. Look at that. Absolutely stunning, look at that. At this angle you can see it, that's amazing. Minute. Hopefully the mic will pick that up. Can you hear that guys? What an amazing piece. A piece of art on the wrist. Fantastic dream and I have to say, I feel very, very privileged to have witnessed that. As a watch enthusiast, a watch aficionado, it's, that is surreal. It's one, it's one, only one, so yes, you can be. Uh, so, Julian, if someone, if anybody was interested in regards to any of the watches they've seen here today, how would they register their interest in regards to Speak Marine? Uh, we work with uh, Watches of Switzerland, Nightbridge, and in Regent Street as well. So Fantastic. So we are present there, so that's where we are uh, mainly located in the UK. Amazing, amazing. Well, Julian, you've been a fantastic host Thank and that we will be here coming. tomorrow. We'll come and say hi and I'll probably take a lot, up a lot of your time tomorrow getting these watches on my wrist. It's going to be a great pleasure. Thank you, sir, Looking for your great forward. hospitality Thank and uh, thank you for giving us an insight behind Speak Marine. Hey, guys, we're outside William Wood at Watch Pro Sell on Live. We've got the founder of William Wood. How are you, sir, today? I am very good. How are you? Not too bad. As you can hear, I'm losing my voice on day two of Watch Pro. So many people here today. Yep. It's going to be an action packed day, I have to say. How are you finding the show so far? So, yesterday was crazy. Um, we used this show as our flagship UK show to invite down our best customers. So, 
We had about six or seven of our top customers coming yesterday. We've got a whole load more coming today. And they've been able to view pieces, purchase pieces. Uh, so it was a really busy day yesterday and we're expecting the same today. Fantastic, fantastic. And we saw you at World Time. Yes. So the guys have been talking about you on the show, I have to say. Good man. A lot of questions, but we want okay. to showcase and highlight some of your new releases yep. that have just come out, sir. Do you want to show us some of your new pieces? Let's do it. So what you've got here is our new limited edition Fearless collection. So as you can appreciate, as a brand that has been inspired by firefighters for the last six years, this is the first time we've moved into an arena where we've produced a watch that a firefighter or a watch enthusiast can wear in an active surrounding. So this watch is a 40 millimeter case, so it's different to our previous models, which were 41. I would say that it wears like a 39 because of the way that we've structured the lugs into the case. It's a matte stealth black sand blasted case, and the dial is inspired by charcoal, so it's got a lovely rough effect to it. We've made the indices rose gold plated, and we've filled them with super luminova so that it has a really nice, rich, strong loom we say for light in the darkest hour. And each of the seconds hands are inspired by the chime of a fire bell, anodized in the color to match each of the watches. And of course, as your listeners know, all of our straps that you see on these watches are made from genuine upcycled firefighting materials. So this yellow strap here is from the West Midlands Fire and Rescue Service. This canvas strap here is actually made from a recycled firefighter gear jacket that firefighters have worn in live fires. This one here, the orange, is from Sacramento Fire Department and it's been used in wildland fires to protect uh, the wildlife all around California. Fantastic, fantastic. And, and what's the retail price of these? The retail price of these models is £895. So really nice and affordable. And that's yep. that was an important point, you see. <clears throat> we needed to make sure that the watches were affordable to both firefighters and first responders. Now, a lot of our customers are watch enthusiasts, yeah. um, but we needed to make sure they're affordable to first responders. And um, how would someone register their interest in your watches? So you've just got to go to our website, williamwoodwatches.com. We've also got a really awesome Instagram platform, at williamwoodwatches. Um, and also something else which is really cool to point out on this piece, just lastly, is of course the case back. So the back of the watch here is oh, yeah. a modern day British brass fire, well, modern day British fiberglass firefighter helmet. Fantastic. And you'll see well, it's got a- I love a, the theme, it's all for a good cause as well, Absolutely, yeah, and, yeah. Um, you guys are really, you know, heading something quite unique. Thank you. In the UK, and you're getting a bit of an international presence now. We are now, yeah. Where people know you in the States and stuff yeah. like that, yeah. off the back of the channel. And we'd yeah. love to feature you guys on our Watch Addiction Club as well. That'd be awesome. We've got yeah. nearly over 100k followers now awesome. in the Facebook group. So it's wow. really, really growing. And I think on the back yeah. of World Time, I had a lot of people ask me, what are those watches all about? Great. I didn't know who they are, and they're very intriguing. Because yeah. you've got a unique color palette as well. Exactly. And the straps yeah. that you use, yeah. they're very unique indeed. And uh, and you were talking about your, your was it your, your grandfather? Yeah, my grandfather was in the fire service for 25 years. So he was stationed up in Newcastle, and he was a massive role model in my life. And has obviously inspired me to do and my lifelong career. Yeah, I mean, this Let's is some cool things the, here. Yeah, this so is what the inspiration of the brand is. And uh, well, look what, at this, guys. Really what you're cool. seeing here is a bit of an evolution of helmets, okay? So oh, right, this okay. helmet here is from the 1920s, worn by firefighters all over Britain. As you can see, the helmet size is questionable, but people yeah, have yeah. Uh, adapted yeah. over time. I think we've grown a little bit we since have, then, haven't we? Have we have grown so, a bit, yeah. And then the evolution is onto this helmet here, which oh, wow. is made from cork. So this Fantastic. is a helmet that my grandfather would have worn a helmet like this. He retired in 1982. Amazing. So it's evolving over time. And then this, of course, is the modern day there firefighter helmet made from fiberglass. So the, you need to get a mascot wearing that and one of your watches. That would be cool. That would be it? cool. Yeah, very cool. I could see myself doing a lovely intro for you guys yeah. with a fire in the background. and I would love that. That would be very cool. You know, look at that. No, you guys are doing really well. I'm really, Thanks, really man. proud of what you're doing. Appreciate it. Representing, you know, British watchmaking. Yeah. You know, from Newcastle as well. I know I've a got uh, one of my moderators, Ian. Yeah. He's a big fan of yours. Yeah, And he's he always talking about you guys. Yeah, uh, big fantastic. advocates. So, um, let's have a look at some of your other timepieces. I, I really let's do like the chronographs. Yeah, me too. This I'm is one of my favorite watches. Tudor 
Monte Carlo fan, tag Monaco. Look at this, this is stunning. Goes with your shirt, sir. Absolutely. Your burgundy. And yours, we're matching. Yeah, yeah, of course, so look at that. The cool thing about this watch, it has dials inspired by a fire engine dashboard. You'll see that the the sub hands are pressure pump gauges that you'd find when a firefighter opens up fire hose. Yes, yes. And then the, the buttons on the side are actually made from the original 1920s oh, firefighter wow. helmet. Actually, yeah. so you're recycling the helmet into a bit the of buttons. history there. God knows exactly. what that scene over the years, right? Yeah. And I always like that your case backs, like, yeah, you know, break cool. like a fire alarm. Exactly. You know, we always try and make in them case playful. Of a fire. Exactly. That's nice fantastic. play on words. Very nice indeed, I have to say. And we have another version of that, which was our Triumph Bronze Jubilee. Mm -hmm. So we did this for the Queen's Platinum Jubilee. It's like a lilac. Kind yeah, of purple. yeah, I exactly. Like and uh, there's not many. It's bronze, is it? It's bronze, yeah. yeah. So it's a bronze case. It's got a lovely jubilee purple dial, um, and then the back of the watch obviously has, in case of fire, break glass in purple. But the straps are made from a purple Japanese fire department fire hose. Look at that. Yeah, very nice. No, I, you got the color palette just right. I have to say. Yeah, yeah. Fantastic. I like the way this is patinaing as well. Yeah. Well done, guys. Congratulations. Thanks and so much. What's the retail price on these once again? The Triumph Collection Stainless Steel retails at two and a half thousand pounds. Yep. And the, the, ju the Jubilee retails at two thousand eight hundred pounds. There's only a hundred pieces of these in the world. Oh wow. Uh, and these are delivering next month. Fantastic. And uh, what movement do these uh, watches host? It's a Swiss-made SW510 by Salita. Fantastic. The entire watch is made, assembled uh, in Switzerland, all parts. Fantastic. So, guys. Do you want to just introduce yourself and what you're all about? Yeah, of What's course. your role at William Woods? So I am the founder, my name's Johnny Garrett. Uh, the brand is dedicated to my grandfather who was a firefighter for 25 years. My role at William Wood is effectively to um, run the business, to make sure that we grow, to make sure that we get more watches on people's wrists. Um, we do a lot for charity. We've donated over $100,000 to firefighting charities around the world, just firefighting charities. Fantastic, fantastic. And as an independent watchmaker, which is only five years old, that's actually a really staggering figure um, and something that we're really, really proud of. Something else I'm proud of is the fact that I've spoken to every single one of our customers over the last five years. That's thousands Amazing. of customers. Personal touch, isn't it? Exactly. For sure. I think Brilliant people stuff. appreciate this. That's really good. Well, look, sir, thank you for your time. You're welcome. You've given us a great insight behind the brand. And we look forward to seeing you at World Time, hopefully again. Yeah. And watch pro events in the future. Sounds and, good. And uh, thank you for showcasing all your watches. These brand new releases, I have to congratulate you. I think they'll do very well, very unique very unique theme and uh, continue what you're doing sir i'm sure you will be a very big success thank you very Take much care, guys, appreciate it and we'll see you soon hey guys we're at one of my favorite brands zinn all the way from germany we've got your the international sales manager one of the guys behind zinn watches how are you Jork, today hi d nice to meet you again yeah we keep on bumping to each other yeah, now yeah. the last few years always a pleasure you showcasing your watches and um, how are you finding the show so far well it's uh, great uh, to be back again in london we've been here last year but this year it's, it's obviously much more crowded than last year yeah. and we see our fans here again and our new uh, customers probably and of, of course you fantastic well look you always get a lot of good feedback in regards to your watches on the channel and also on our facebook group the watch addiction club we have a lot of people posting Zin watches in the group and it's always a pleasure and they're always in very high regard. What have you got on Showcase today? What would you like to show us today? Sure. Uh, well, I would like to introduce uh, once more the company and uh, one of our main technologies. If you, uh, yes, yes, talk us through it. And then I, I have two watch models with me, um, one diving watch and one pilot watch, and uh, there are always stories behind it. Uh, like you know, we are calling ourselves uh, Sin Special, which means special watches. Yes. We are well known for functional uh, watches, mission timers, military um, watches, pilot watches, and so on. Yeah. We are based in Frankfurt, Germany, a mid-sized company, already 61 years old, um, around uh, 140 people working for us, and uh, yeah, my name is Jorg and I'm the sales manager, and Fantastic. I 
would like to introduce you to one of the main technologies we're providing with some of our watches. We call it Tegeman technology and it's an anti-scratch resistant technology. See, you see this is a normal stainless steel case and I'm using a screwdriver and you can easily scratch it. Yes, yes. Yeah. And we have developed a special technology, a special process um, to harden uh, wow, steel that's parts. amazing. So that's a bezel from a diving watch made of a submarine steel. And as you can see, you wow. can't scratch it. Wow, so and that's that, better than ceramic or even... No, it's uh, stainless steel, made of submarine steel in this case. Fantastic. And uh, there's another level I, I would like to show you on top for the um, black parts from us, like uh, that black bezel here. We have a PVD coating, um, and also this PVD coating is wow. scratch resistant, as you can see. So, just general rule: all the black parts from us, cases, crowns, buckles, uh, bezels, which are black, are scratch resistant, as a um, shade here. Fantastic, fantastic, and. Um, this is a pilot's watch, as I can That's see, a, very a legible, watch. hard to say, fantastic. Um, it's, the, it's the 717, it's the 717, and the story, there's a story behind it. Uh, once, um, uh, in, in a couple of years ago, a former military jet pilot who uh, flew the Tornado uh, jet in the German Bundeswehr Luftwaffe, right. um, they have a, a cockpit watch in the tornado cockpit um, from Sin, a mechanical one. And he asked us, could we have um, a wristwatch um, designed similar um, to the cockpit uh, clock watch? Fantastic. And that's the that's the result. Fantastic. Yeah. Amazing looking watch, I have to say. Very legible. And this is treated in your new technology. Yeah. Well. We do have the Tegeman technology with the PVD coating. We have the AR technology with the a little capsule at the side, which captures moisture, uh, which you eventually get into the case and uh, into the Amazing. movement, just to eling uh, elongate source times. And one special thing is we have a minute counter from the center. You see the orange hand on Amazing. 12 o'clock. We have a turning bezel and a turning sapphire crystal. Wow. So the original cockpit watch did have the bezel and the sapphire crystal as a unit. And we tried to adapt that to the wristwatch. And here is the result. I'll leave an image of the cockpit so you can see the similarities yeah. there. Yeah. As you can see, guys, it looks amazing. Straight from the cockpit, I have to say. Yeah. When it's taken, it's true inspiration absolutely amazing i like the splash of orange on the hands fantastic beautiful beautiful legible aviation pilot's watch i have to say and what else have we got here uh, uh, another another uh, diving uh, diving watch from us from the um, u1 series this time with a blue color yeah legendary U1 series, 44 in millimeters, tegumented um, bezel, also available fully tegumented for a little sweatshirt, available on different colors of leather strap, uh, on metal bracelet, um, and on leather. Amazing, amazing. And what's the retail price of this? Uh, I have to check. <laughs> Fantastic. And what movement does this host? Um, Celita? It's a Celita movement, uh, yeah. SW200. We're always using Swiss movements uh, from Celita, La Jubilee and Concepto. Always top of premium quality. Amazing. And if anyone's interested in these timepieces or any of the timepieces you've got here on display, how would they register their interest in terms of purchasing a piece? We have several partners over here in the UK, uh, online and offline. Uh, have a look at our website. You see the, find all the contact information. We have a service center over here at TWR, or you just uh, browse to our website um, at sin.de. 
and have a look um, on all the collection we, we offer to our Senate fans in the United Kingdom. Fantastic. Well, sir, thank you once again. You are a regular on the D-Time Love Channel. And uh, guys, check out their pieces on the Zim website. Uh, we do have a few authorised dealers here in the UK as well. The brand, how long have we gone for? 60 years, you said? Sorry, How 61 years. 61 years, wow. So Zin is a well-established brand, and this is the international sales manager behind Zin. Thank you, sir, once again for spending the time to showcase these pieces, and that we hope to see you at World Time and Watch Pro Live next year, sir. Take care. Thank you. Take Thank care. you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Feels just like you Go outside and be kind to a stranger Watch what happens every time you do Ooh, yeah. Make your own sunshine Smoke cause it's alright